On this episode of In the Spotlight, we take you to a store that's designed to make you feel at home in Tacoma's 6th Avenue Business District. I'm Troy Smith. And I'm Lacey Lind, and this is Rustin Mercantile. Rustin Mercantile is a new furniture and home decor store based at the head of Tacoma's 6th Avenue Business District. Owners Lacey and Troy feature consignment merchandise and quality refurbished furniture. They opened their doors in 2017 and they're already making a name for themselves. We have mid-century modern, classic farm style, um, kind of just brings a good mixture of people into our store. It's kind of a family we've created here. Um, all the people we've met, we all kick in to make this dream work. Their primary business plan involves consignment with local vendors, which means retail goods are mostly local in so many ways. We spent a good amount of time meeting a bunch of local vendors that kind of wanted their own little space in a store like this, and that's kind of what brings it together, is that there's just everyone else supporting us. Lacey says that consignment sales are a win-win. New stock continually comes into the store, and vendors get a fair price point with sales. They brought their stuff in on consignment, so it's a different percentage and they don't get paid till it's sold. So that's helping us out by us not having to upfront the cost, and it's helping them out by getting in the store and they actually get a higher percentage, but it might take longer for them to get that, the money. Troy brings with him a solid background from the lumber industry, building and refurbishing furniture, while Lacey focuses on marketing products. She says customers do notice the look. With our customers, they come in here and they see this place looking like their home and they enjoy the fact that like, we stage it so nicely that they can picture the dresser being in their, in their bedroom or the sideboard being in their dining room. So they, they value the way that we merchandise things, but they also value the pricing that we have on our furniture. We do an awesome job with our refinishing and they appreciate that. And we do have a lot of people moving up from California and Seattle to Tacoma and they need new furniture. And, they can get something that's solid wood that's been repurposed. The birth of Rustin Mercantile flowed from the careers of both Lacey and Troy. He worked in the lumber in the lumber industry for 12 years, and even more before that. Well, before that, yeah. And so for him, he knew wood. He knew the products. And my background is retail. I worked at Nordstrom and did merchandising for years and all that. And so for me, I loved that part, but I didn't want to work in Seattle or for a large corporation. Some small businesses are true mom and pop operations. In Lacey and Troy's case, their personal relationships work well with their business plans. I don't think it's more stressful that we work together, I think it's more stressful that we're running a small business together. That's the part that's a little bit more stressful. But yes, I, I take work home. I'm on Facebook and Instagram constantly answering questions to customers and either I'm here or he's here or he's in the garage while I'm working the store. So we're kind of, again, just tag teaming it all the time to where... Work opposite schedules. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> As partners at work and partners in life, Lacey and Troy say the Rustin Mercantile definitely has a robust staff of employees. Being a small business, Being a small business, uh, we can pay ourselves much easier than we can pay someone else because we yeah. don't get paid at all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Location means everything in business, and with Russ and Mercantile, it worked well for the owners with their affiliation with the 6th Avenue Business District. Originally when we opened, we did think we were going to go down to Point Rustin and have our name actually make sense. But, you know, 6th Ave was so much more than what we anticipated to where we can't leave this community and this family. It's been so great to us. Why would we change that? Russ and Mercantile has big plans for their financial future. Thinking maybe a little coffee shop at one point built into the store so people can hang out, have coffee, and shop at the same time. And you know, obviously, we go with the trends. So if things start changing, we start moving. And so it's it's constantly changing. I mean, this, people come in the store weekly, and they still can't imagine how we change this entire place in a week. Troy and Lacey both share a passion for Tacoma that comes from growing up in the city. They feel Rustin Mercantile is a sound investment in a business and into their own quality of life. And this is home. You know, I love to give back to the community and, you know, these, we're all friends and family here. Everyone says hi. You know, it's really developed in the last five years. I was technically born in Seattle, but I was <laughs> raised in Tacoma. So for us, both being raised in Tacoma, like, we obviously want everyone to experience this with us. And with all of our friends being in Tacoma, what better way of them seeing it and helping us out and shopping with us is us being here. 